Hey Pisces, welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Nelly A.K. Awotero and I'm here to bring you guys your weekend love reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what's going on with you guys for this weekend. We're going to see what are your overall messages and the possible outcomes. Guys, before we get started, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. It allows me to connect with you energetically and it definitely helps me out with the growth of the channel. As you all know, my readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. If the reading resonating, you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The info is in the description box below. And as always, I want to thank each and every one of you for all your love and support. It is truly appreciated. So we're going to go ahead and get started here, guys. We're going to see what is the overall energy for you. We're going to see what are the messages for this weekend and what is your possible outcome. So we're going to go ahead and start off with your Oracle Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians. Overall messages for my Pisces here, please. What is their overall love messages for the weekend here for my Pisces? One more, Universe, please. One more. <clears throat> Alrighty, Pisces. So the first card that came out is space. I need more time to think. Understanding. I see your side of the story. And then the final card is unsatisfied. I wasn't happy the way things were going. So Pisces, you're dealing with a, per, uh, a connection here where I feel you've been in separation from this individual for quite a bit now. Um... You guys both needed the space. You and this person both needed some time to think about the situation before you took any type of initiative or made any final decision. I feel that at this point, this person and you are at this energy where you guys can see the side of the other person's story. Like you can understand why the things happen the way they happen or they understand why you reacted to a certain situation with them. They totally get you at this point, okay? And with unsatisfied, I feel that the reason why all of this kicked up, Pisces, is because you weren't happy where things were going, okay? You were not happy whatsoever. It's like one minute you and this person were in such a good place, life was good, everything was fine, and out of nowhere, things just got screwed up. And this just happened overnight. It was just like a matter, of, it was just like a domino effect. It happens really, really fast, and you weren't even expecting any changes like this. So this is why you may have even asked this person for some time, because you needed to think about what you wanted to do moving forward. And I feel that this person also needed the space as well. There was just a lot of things going on at that time that neither you nor this person were happy with, okay? So let's go ahead and see what's going on here. I am hearing spirit keeps on saying, this person's coming back. They're coming back because they've had their time to think. And I feel that this person's coming back and they're ready to make an offer here, okay? Universe, archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians. Please help me give Pisces clear and concise messages regarding the situation with the person on their mind. What is going on with this person universe? What is the situation with the person on their mind? Overall energy between these two universe, please. Overall energy. I have the nine of wands in the reverse. And yeah, exactly the energy that I'm getting. Both you and this person have been through a battle, okay? You guys have been through a battle. It's been a lot. Um, both parties had tried to defend themselves, explain themselves and their actions. And you both are at this point with the Nine of Wands where, one, you're tired of the battle. And two, I feel that both you and this person are tired of being without each other. And three, neither one of you guys really want to give up on this connection. I feel that you and this person, after a time apart, somebody's been separated from this individual for about a year almost, okay? So it's been quite a bit. I feel that after a time apart from this person, there is a reunion getting ready to happen here okay there's definitely a reunion that's getting ready to happen here and there's a stable new beginning right um waiting for you and for this person okay there's an opportunity to finally bring this connection back into union and have a stable new beginning like this time around things are different there's no more of those friends that were interfering in the past or exes interfering in the past i'm hearing it's like things have totally changed for this person and for yourself i feel that both you and this person have grown individually mentally physically and emotionally and there's a lot of changes that have happened in the separation and i feel that both you and this person are mature now and wanting to come together and bring those that growth into this connection what else universe what else is going on here 
with the eight of pentacles in the reverse so this is an energy of wanting to rebuild the connection okay so you and your person the person that is on your mind the person that is, you are in separation with are both wanting to rebuild this connection you guys are wanting to give this relationship another chance what is this person's overall energy towards pisces universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians overall energy towards pisces with the queen of pentacles pisces you may be dealing with an earth sign here hang on a second So, Pisces, as I was saying, this person's energy towards you is the Queen of Pentacles. This person has an intention to come in and make an offer. This time around, the offer that this person is going to be bringing into the connection is a stable one, okay? I feel it's a mature one, Spirit keeps saying. I feel that in the past, when you and this individual first met, it, it was like... You guys were meant to be with each other. You, you felt like this was your soulmate. You felt like this is the person that you wanted to be with. But the timing was wrong. This person probably wasn't done partying, wasn't done going out and about, was still dealing with negative people. Maybe exes were still interfering. The time wasn't right then. But now, after this time and separation, after this space apart from each other and being able to understand why the other person acts the other way or acts the way that they do, it's like now this person has matured. They've matured, Pisces, and they're in this energy where they're ready to make offers. And we're not talking about little petty-ass page of pentacles in the reverse offers. No, we're talking about big boy, big girl offers. Like, okay, I'm ready to work on this connection. I'm ready to see what we can head in this connection. I don't just want to date you. I have an intention to marry you. What else is the overall energy here from this person towards Pisces universe? Two of Swords. See, this person is no longer indecisive. They've made a decision. They clearly know what they want. They know where they're heading to. They know how they want this connection to lead and how they want what's the outcome that they want in this situation. A very mature individual now. I feel in the past you were dealing with somebody who just was not ready. Right person, wrong time. Okay? And now it's the right person, right time. With the page of swords here, I feel that this individual is getting ready to come in, Pisces. They want to have an important conversation with you, okay? This person wants to clear the air with you. They want to explain why in the past they weren't ready and how sorry they are for putting you through what they put you through. You and this person, it's like when you guys first met, everything was just right. You fell in love with this person. They fell in love with you. You guys may have even moved in together really quick. Like, everything was going just right, but the timing was just wrong. And now it's it, the time is right. The time is right to be able to bring this connection back into, into fruition and be able to work on it once again. What is this person's overall intentions with my Pisces universe, Archangel Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians? It's the Queen of Swords, again, to bring in some truth and bring in some clarity. It's to take the initiative in this, in this situation and figure things out with you. It's like taking control of whatever is um in the upheaval whatever is confused and bringing it back in and getting it all um all cleared up okay i feel that this person is coming in a very stable individual with um clear and concise messages with clarity this person is bringing in truth and clarity and it's about time because it's been a while since you've been able to really sit down with this individual and clear the air what else are their intentions towards my pisces universe with the empress this person has one mission and one mission only pisces is to make you their wife or make you their husband this person is coming in with truth clarity and a plan this person has a plan to reunite with you. This person has a plan to bring this connection back into fruition. This person has a plan to be with you once again. Final intention here towards my Pisces universe, please. Final intention. Oh, you're going to give me two. With the devil in the reverse, this person has released toxicity. And with the king of wands, I feel that this person has seen their actions. It's like they had an out-of-body experience, okay? I don't know if you've ever had one of those I have where I finally seen myself um doing things that i shouldn't have been doing and by me experiencing it with my very own eyes it woke me up from that negativity and it pulled me away from that negative cycle i feel that this person went through the same thing they had an out-of-body experience they seen the way they were acting with others or they were acting with you how they were being toxic evil manipulating and controlling and this person with the king of wands here a very charismatic good looking individual this individual can talk a person's skin off if need be okay he can sell water 
to a thirsty person. Like, he can do whatever the fuck he needs to do or she needs to do, and they will get their way. This individual seen their actions. They seen the way that they were acting with others. They seen how they were mistreating people, especially you. And now this person has taken a different direction, has released the toxicity, no longer trying to entertain toxic individuals, toxic friends, even toxic family members. For some of you guys, there was, I just heard there was an ex-wife or an ex-husband that kept on interfering. This person has already removed that person out of their life. They finalized that situation, that relationship. They maybe even divorced this individual. I'm unsure, but there's an energy of them no longer dealing with the ex, okay? What is the outcome in this situation for Pisces and the person universe? What is the outcome? I got the Queen of Wands in the reverse with the Three of Cups. So this person has released any third-party situations. Again, like I told you, if there was an ex-wife, an ex-husband interfering in this connection in the past, or maybe friends or family members that were interfering in the past, your person has released all of those negative people, all those negative tendencies, all those partying lifestyles that they had. This person is ready to come towards you, no longer deal with third parties and come towards you for a reunion and a reconciliation. This person has had a a lot of time to themselves to really think about what they want and how they want to move forward with you and with this queen of cups here you again your energy this person is at the point where they're now they're ready to have a four of wands with you a happily ever after and it took them a while here in Herman mode because they really needed to see their actions and really make some big boy big girl decisions and I feel that they're at that point already in this situation where they finally see the side of your story they finally understand where you're coming from they understand that you were not happy nor satisfied with the relationship the way it was going back then. And they needed some time to really figure things out. Now this person has gotten everything in perspective and they're ready to move on and move forward with you. This person's coming back, Pisces. They're ready to reconcile, but you're going to be dealing with a mature person now. They're wanting to have their happily ever after. You guys once before spoke about buying a home together, having a family together. If not bringing a family together, that's exactly what's going to be happening in this situation. Final messages for my Pisces universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Final messages for my Pisces, please. Final messages for my Pisces. Children, your love life is being affected by children. So I feel that there was a lot of childlike energies around your person. There could have even been, you know, baby mamas or baby daddies that were interfering in the connection. But after all that turmoil and after everything you went through, it was worth the wait, okay? Because now this person is going to come in here. This person is going to give you the love that you've been um, yearning for. The love that you've been waiting for in this connection. I feel that this person is finally free and they're ready to move forward and they're ready to bring this connection back into fruition. So now at this point, they can finally put the work in the connection. All right, Pisces, I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. And if you want to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.